<laughs> okay. Um, let's talk about Connect. This is the second time we're doing this video. The first. You don't need to so know well. that. I know. Well, a little behind the scenes. Okay, Connect. Um, it's looking at me right now. This is the Xbox Connect. Yes. Uh, typically, I mean, it came out. When did it come out? I don't even know. It came out uh, years ago. Um, there's two versions now. There's actually, wait, actually, I think there's three versions. This is version one. This is the first one that came out. And when it came out, it was kind of amazing. It was this Xbox controller where you could like play tennis without a controller. You stand in front of your TV in the living room and you like wave your hands around and no, do the, stuff. No, the Kinect had a like a controller with a ball, like a Wii remote. Oh. Had like a colored ball on the end. Okay. Well, what, what this camera actually is, it's a structured light sensor. Um, it's actually a three-dimensional camera, so it can tell how far away the things are in the scene. From that, can, it can kind of infer the structure of what's going on in your scene. So it can track your skeleton. It can sort of tell where people are and stuff. So um, the way it works is you've got three, three of these holes on the front of the camera. This one is actually a projector. This one's an infrared camera, and this one is a color camera. So the projector is projecting out this dot pattern of infrared dots. Um, and the, the pattern is actually has a structure to it. It looks random, but it, it actually has a structure. And the camera knows what that structure should be. And if someone is standing in the scene, the pa their, their body is going to interrupt that pattern that's being projected out. Mm -hmm. And by looking at how that pattern is disrupted by the objects in the scene, it can determine how far away those things are because there's a distance here between, there's like a parallax mm -hmm. you know, shift between what's projected and what's seen. And from that, I can tell how far away things are. It's really cool. And um, immediately people started using these cameras for things other than the Xbox game console. Uh, artists started to use it. So here we have the Kinect plugged in. It's looking at you and it's spinning up. This is using an object called jit.freenec.grab. And um, jit.freenec.grab will access the Kinect directly from Max, which is pretty cool. The Kinect 1. It doesn't work on the Kinect 2. We'll show the Kinect 2 later. But it spits out two videos. The first one is this grayscale video, and the second one is just a plain old RGB video. Um, now, why isn't the normalization happening here? Yeah, I know. Oh, it's, it is. It's just your can is in the way. Oh, there my we can. Go. My soda. Okay, Sorry. so there we go. When I get out of the way, then you become obvious. Um, so. And it's still flickering. Oh, oh now you're. Now I'm in the scene. All right, let's get right. out. Come on. There we go. There we go. All right. Now, can I still, can you still hear me? People still hear me? All right. Okay, so we've got this RGB, we've got this um, depth map, and then if we do a little processing on the depth map, here I'm just normalizing, uh, but I'll explain that later. Essentially, I'm doing brightness and contrast on the depth map in order to make it more contrasty, and you can see the structure here. The brighter stuff is, the closer it is to the scene. So if you move your hands forward, you can see uh, they become the brightest things in the scene. They're the closest things to the camera. I don't know what that flickering is about. I think there maybe is something wrong with my Kinect, but I don't know. It's kind of flickering in and out. Um, but it works really well. And we could blob track these, but oh, cool. Neat. So just an example of how the Kinect knows how far away things are. That's all you really need to know at this point. The Kinect can tell you how far away the stuff in the scene is, uh, no matter how goofy it is. It can tell how far away it is. All right, let's stop Goofy. there. Move on to the Wait, next no, thing. You 